Forgive me, Father, for I've sinned. It's been like two months since my last confession. It's been over three years, Rick. Oh, it's kind of embarrassing, but here's how the whole thing went down. I had fallen in love, and her name was Nina Pennington. Hi, I'm Rick Stevens. I'm a slow kid from Latin class, I know. Unfortunately, this is pretty much a true story. Who said that you could talk to my girlfriend, douchebag? I'm not your girlfriend, Kevin. You're a dead man. Ricky! It's very important to try new things. You're trying to seduce me? I want to be your teacher. You can just raise your hand if you have any questions. <laughs> You've opened a brothel. They can touch you, but you can't touch them. Rick? Why are all these girls naked? Yeah, it's weird, right? Everybody freeze! I think this is what my parents were trying to shelter me from. At the rate your family and friends keep going to jail, you should put me on a permanent retainer. I have a message for you from God. Stop being such a screw-up. Oh, and don't lose faith. All I ever wanted was for you to like me. I mean, this is the most exciting thing I've ever done. You're in quite the pickle, aren't you? What is going on in here? I'm working on putting a breakfast buffet in here. Eggs and sausage and a lap dance. All in $12.99. Put you in prison with an inmate who will eat your head while you're sleeping. Shouldn't we call the police? I, I don't think that's necessary. This totally reminds me of a German porno I downloaded. <sighs> Oddly enough, actually I had fun. Guess we'll have to do it again sometime.